guys, it's Coaster Central here, back with another video. And today we're going to be talking about what I think the most important part of a roller coaster is. Now, tons of things go into making a roller coaster what a roller coaster is, including the originality of the layout, the pacing, and the sequencing of the elements. Now, before we start this video, please consider subscribing because this video took so long to make, like it got corrupted and everything. So, like, all my pain would go away though if you just liked and subscribed. Anyway, enjoy this video. Now let's start off with the sequencing of a roller coaster because this is actually very important. It's the order that the elements come in. In fact, the reason that I then rank Nemesis as my number one roller coaster is because of the order that the elements come in. The terrain work and the intensity are also there, but because the sequencing of this coaster is so unique and not just like, you know, Nemesis Inferno, makes it really good ride. And I hate Nemesis, I don't like Nemesis Inferno as much as Nemesis because of its sequencing. Anyway, next up let's talk about the pacing of a roller coaster. Because whilst Nemesis does have good pacing, it doesn't compare to the pacing of Wicker Man, which is a family coaster by the way guys. It absolutely flies through its layout, never gives up, is so unbelievably relentless. Wicker Man is just such a good ride and the Bet and the better pacing even like just makes it even better, and it is edging closer and closer to becoming better than thirteen in my rankings. And for a wooden coaster as well that was built literally last year, this ride is just flying so much. And even though it's a family coaster, it still packs an incredible punch. Next up, let's talk about the originality because the originality of Rita's layout, it's not very good. So that's that's a bad example. Don't be like Rita. It's got a very bad layout and it's just not very good. And an example of a pretty good road coaster with a very original layout that has never been done before, well, when it was made at least, is Colossus. Because whilst it has been cloned across the globe, when it was first made, the layout was very original. Like, I don't think good old B&M would do, like, this quadruple barrel roll. Like... They would never do that, they just stick to their corkscrews, which is why I think that makes Glossus a well-paced coaster, well not well-paced, but a very good layout coaster, and I think that explains why originality is very important. Now, after I've looked at all of these rides and sort of looked at them and said, well, this ride is good because of that, and this ride is good because of that, I, thought, I think that the pacing of the coaster makes a ride good, because you can have sequencing and originality, but none of those matter when the pacing isn't bad. Because you can have great elements, but you can just go through them slow and it'd be bad. Anyway, please consider subscribing and like this video because this took so long to make. And anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next YouTube video.